Hello viewers, thanks for joining us once again. It's the sixth game of our um, truncated league season this year and it's a home game, Sonnerstead first 11 versus Chessington. It's cold, it's a bit overcast but hopefully it's going to be dry. Um, and uh, yeah, 40 over a side game. Let's join the action. Here we go, Sander said, winning the toss and batting Jake Scarisbrick and Tyler Ward to open. And it's cold today, viewers. It's about 16 degrees. A little bit of wobble there. Ah, trademark from Jake there, and that's first boundary, first runs. Runs in front of the square there for Jake. Probably won't go. The grass is very long. Um, there was an attempt to mow it by young Brandon. He spent four hours on Thursday going round and round and round in circles on the mower, but uh, he forgot to put the cutters down. Funny old game. Little look at the league table, such as it is after five games um, out of seven. Sarnestead in fifth and Chessington at the bottom. That's a lovely shot from Tyler. Sparing dive, but uh, yeah, there's only one place that was going to go. Oh, what a jaffer! And T, a little bit aerial, a little bit uppish, but um, he was on, in control of that. Good leave. And that's an edge. And four. Didn't know much about that. 20 for none off six, Sanderstead. Watchful start. A bit high there. Uh, Gains some pretty good bowling here on a track that's. Ah, that looks good. Ah, that's nice. Down the ground for Jake. And it's gone. Well, rough winds do shake the darling buds of May and summer's lease. Half all too short a date. A bit of Shakespeare there for you viewers, but um, sums it up really. Uh, this is the 29th of August, season's nearly over. Summer seems to have turned into autumn and it's cold and windy. That's nicely hit. Jake going in front of square. Oh, over the top, chipped beautifully. Oh, that's a lovely shot from Jake. That's four runs straight through the covers. Beautiful. Guided. Guided. Well, he really is. He's playing pretty well today. Shots all around the wicket. So I've got club legend Tim Payne with me. He's playing in our fifth 11. Tim, as it's uh, cold today, our theme of the day is um, words that rhyme with cold but you're not allowed to choose one that's already been said. What have you got? Uh, I've got bold. That's good, because you're the first one, so you can't possibly get it wrong. Well done, mate. Thank you. Thank you. So I've got... Oh, uh, Tyler's gone off stump. Lovely Yorker, that, actually. Um, pretty well bold. Anyway, Johnny, Johnny Longcock. Um, as it's cold today, words that rhyme with cold, please, but one that hasn't been said before. What have you got? How many have been said? How many words have been said? Just, before? just, just come out with it. I'm going to go for bold, as in bold Brilliant. statement. That's absolutely fantastic because we've only had one, and that was it. Bold. Oh. So, <laughs> love oh, it. Oh no, I changed. <laughs> oh, can I have the other one? <laughs> can I have a different one? John Coles in at three, and um, DC. What have you got for us? Uh, gold. 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 Yeah. No, no one said that. That's a good one. I've got the Archbishop with me. Um, Richard, as it's cold today, I'm after words that rhyme with cold that haven't already been said, and I'm not going to tell you what's been said. What have you got? Straight away. Untold. Untold. Very good. Nice. Ooh, that's a lovely shot. Wow. Super duper. You see the Archbishop there, a wise man. He, uh, he went for the second syllable. And why not? Played. Oh, that could be played. Yeah, it's just just sliding down there. I'm not. Yeah, we're watched. I'm... That's in the air, and that's oh, dropped. Wow. 
Big let off there for Jake. Relatively simple chance. 56 for one, it's the 19th over. Make that 60. Ah, goes aerial. Couple of bounces. So, T, word that rhymes with cold, mate, that no one said yet. A word that rhymes with cold. Consoled. Very good. You've, you've done the Archbishop trick, which is bringing the second syllable. It's got to yeah. be done. It's got to be done. It's got to be done. Of course, the uh, the inexperienced out there didn't. didn't oh, think that's, of that. a, that's rookie, that. Oh, I mean, you know, Johnny and, and, and DC. Yeah. Anyway, what do you think? I think this is a really good start. Obviously, disappointed to be back in the heart, but hopefully, took some of the shine off so these boys Definitely. can carry on. Definitely. That's a, an interesting shot from Jake. He's hit a lot, a lot today that hasn't been in between uh, Point and Gully. <laughs> <laughs> it's doing well. I love it. Halfway through, 68 for one. Platform is there, the scene is set. Sarno said should be looking yeah, to go at sort of at least six, seven over from here. 200 maybe, target. Right, let's see. It's a nice shot, that's gone away. And that's a lovely shot. 15 overs left, 86 for one. Sana said really should be looking to go through the gears now. But it's not easy out here. Jake definitely struggling with something. I don't know if it's cramp or something, but Tyler's out there running for him. I think Jake's probably just going to try and hit everything. See what happens. He's put down again. That'll be another two there. Well, it looks like Jake, uh, whilst Tyler got in, Jake was sort of standing around slightly outside of his crease and um, quite rightly he's been given out. Uh, Twelve and a half overs left. Chris Bowman comes in at four. Ah, now that is a shot of real quality. Oh, a bold. Super delivery. Oh, that's a nicely hit. Got Chris. Yeah, it's beating the man. So, I've got Jake Scaz with me there. Um, Jake, you won't get out like that again, will you, mate? Well, oh, absolutely not. I won't be that again. <laughs> anyway, um, enough of that. So, what's your word, uh, word for, that rhymes with cold that no one said yet? I'm not going to tell you what everyone has said. Smold. Smold? Very good. I'm not sure that's a word, yeah, mate. Yeah, because to smolder is the verb. Yeah. So, so if you gave someone a smolt. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh we'll dear. have to check that. Yeah, well, I don't think we do need I don't think we need to check it, mate. <laughs> but you know, nice attempt. <laughs> Just the one there. Ten overs left. Sana said want two hundred, they've got to go at nine and a half and over. And it's not, not that easy. Oh, and that's uh, nicely flighted. Chris just plays over it. Uh, George Jackson in. If anyone can hit nine and over, it's this man. And more good bowling. Well, I have to say, these Chessington spinners have done a damn good job. Uh, slight commentator's curse there as he gets hits for six but um it's got to happen now Sam said they've got to they've got to put their foot on the gas he's picked up everything today that fielder great work oh that's tossed up and uh, hit away and that's gone it's uh Ah, it almost looked like it kept a little low. Maybe did he get a little snick on it? Anyway, it's um, out, and that's uh, 116 for four. It's a 30 second over. And the need for speed has caused a little bit of a mini collapse. Quick bowler back on now. Slow bowler had a very good spell the left arm. Jack Coles in at six, joining his brother John, and that's gone straight through and beat everybody. Uh, very useful, four buys. Nervy. 
Well, the Chessington lads are calling this bowler Hagrid. Well, and why not? Ooh. Where's that gone? That's top edged. Can't set a feel for that. Six overs left now. Two hundreds not going to happen. Maybe 160, 170 is a more realistic. Well, it's, it just isn't easy to score. It'll be the same for both sides, I imagine. Similar pattern to last week, viewers. Uh, Sana says set 160. Uh, thought it might be enough, then it looked like it wasn't. Ultimately, it was. An absolute thriller game. Ah, John's gone. Gone for the big one. That's a lovely shot. That's six. More like a nine. That is, uh, that's a big hit. Well, that's a nice hit. Couple of bounces into the hedge. So Jack joins his brother in hitting boundaries. It's good. Last four. The Coles brothers. Ronnie and Reggie. Ooh, that's a wide. Three overs left. Looks like uh, long cock there. Padded up. Ready to go in. Get the jelly copter out. Ten and over gets us to 180. And uh, that's John gone. That's five down now. Not quite what was uh, wanted. That said, it was a good innings from John. Uh, it's been pretty quiet this this season, his debut season, but uh, showed us a bit of bit of what uh, what he can do there. Good knock. Uh, 17 balls left for Longcock. The scene is set. Oh, that one uh, lifted. That's a good shot. That's a really good shot. Just beautiful. And again, just be one there. Everyone's gone out on the leg side boundary. Johnny gives us a one handed jellycopter, but just for a single. That's a nice hit, but oh, and another one down. Just dipped on him late there. Not easy. Cold, cold hands. Two overs left. Well, 180 could could be doable. Good hit, but it's just one. Oh, a little misfield there. Longcock comes back for the second and makes it. Big wipe there from Johnny. They're going to look for two here again. And they're going to get it. Good running. Oh, Johnny goes to one there. And that's uh, a big old six. Super jellycopter there. Fabulous. God, a few more there would be good. Oh, doesn't get that, but... Four balls left, 176. That's hit well. That's through the gap for four. That's 180. With three balls left. Well hit, probably just one. Oh, big swing and a miss. Well, that didn't work. So, 1 8 1, the final score. I think Sarnasil would have taken that at the start of the game. Well, George still struggling with the side screen. It's um, Dan Carey to open the bowling. And why not? Simon Carter, skipper, up the hill. Bowling is uh, little medium pace dibbly dobblies. Oh, bowling. Oh, Tyler going for a bit of a cheeky stumping. That just was gone. Normal service resumed from this vantage point. And we can watch side bowling is. Oh, oh, hello, hello. That's gone. That's an absolutely magnificent bit of work from Tyler. Um, really was absolutely fantastic. Uh, that's one for not many, and this is the fourth over. Oh, bowl. And uh, Bob, you and I are playing tomorrow in the Sunday team, aren't we, mate? I'm really looking forward to it, Dan. It's my uh, 46th season playing at the old sawmill. Excellent. This uh, is my 35th, I think. And I think we could be opening the batting, Dan, oh, to God, try no, and I'd... shore up the. Uh, the codger middle order. Now that, that would be a mistake, I'm sure that's not the case. Anyway, viewers, keep tuned for that, I'm sure we'll get it filmed somehow. Oh, what a jaffer. I've got Luke with me, the uh, Chessington club captain, 
Um, well done, Stay, mate. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, it's all right. Yeah, yeah we'll bowl. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. A few drop catches. But, uh, we'll ah, that, absolutely. What number are you coming in? I'll probably be 10 or 11. Oh, right. Think. Okay, yeah. fair enough. So, yeah, the yeah. boys can do the job for us. Yeah. Absolutely. Anyway, you told me you, uh, you're trying to trying to get some new nets at Chessington. Yeah, we are. So we um, we had some nets built about 16 years ago for a memorial uh, for one of our cults that sadly passed away. Yeah. And um, his mum and dad are fully involved in the club still. With dad's the, dad is the groundsman still. Okay. And his mum, uh, the mum does the teas for us. Um, Brilliant. So Good it's family really stuff. The club. Yeah, and it was a sad a sad time. Obviously. Yeah, of course. Um, he was killed on his way to work experience. So oh no! So it was a sad day, um, but we've had a little memorial game every year in his memory. Yeah. And um, we built the nets, to say about 15, 16 years ago, yeah. for um, in the, in the memorial for him. So we're looking to raise some money. Um, we've got a just given page going. Brilliant. Um, we've raised just under three grand so far uh -huh. of our ten grand targets. Ten grand and target. It's only been going just over a week. That's okay, a brilliant, brilliant start. Um, okay. We're just hoping that we can get some more contributions from people around the county or the other clubs. Great. If anyone can chip in, it'll be absolutely blind. Yeah, no, we're we're always up for helping causes like that. So um, there'll be a link below, viewers, and uh, if anyone wants to help Chessington get their net in an excellent cause for the the cricketing family that we all are, then um, yeah, please please do so. Appreciate it. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers, Luke. All the best. Cheers. Oh, yeah. Bolden, that's well. That's not out. So I didn't really notice any any nick. Good ball though. Oh, that's just chipped up. Oh, just out of Jacko's reach. Oh, that's a fidge. That's going to run away. Ah, oh, Simon continues. Oh, he's swinging it both ways. And the ball. Rolling. It's a nice shot, a little bit one handy, but it's uh, it's gone and it's four. Oh, the wind's really picking up here, viewers. I think it's a curse of being actually the highest cricket ground in London. Uh, so they say. Oh, that's got to be close. And it is, yeah. So it's been swinging them back all day, and uh, if you miss. You're in trouble. It's two down. Nice jump there from Jacko. Oh, that's got to be close. And it is. That's full bunger. Um, wow, that's three down. All three to Simon. Oh, that's a good, uh, good hit. Straight to Jacko, though, who really doesn't drop anything. Um, DC joins the party. That's uh, four down now. Bowling. It's good stuff from DC. It's only his second game for the first 11. Played a game early last season. Good little bowler. Good metronomic action. Swings it a little bit. And the ball. Oh, a bold. What's well, a lovely pickup. That's gone for six. Fantastic shot. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, it hit something on the way through. That was pad. Bowling. It's a nice shot. Another good over. Tom Batham's on now, replacing DC. After an excellent spell. And the score is... There we go, 43 for four. And this is the... Um, I think that's 16 gone. And it's cold and wet down here. And that's... Uh, Pulled away, short ball, and that's four runs into the net. A nice shot, it's in the air. And it's safely caught, John Coles there, that's five down. Tom Battams, there's a wicket. And um, yeah, could be in the bar, earlier than expected. There we go, 
23 overs left to get whatever 135 or something and Johnny Longcock into the attack his first bowl of the day and uh, gets away with that oh that's gone in the air easy one the DC Longcock strikes the second ball very good ah, contest here Johnny right arm round to left hander He'll like that. All off his love bowling to left hander, I certainly did. Yeah, full toss. Clipped away nicely into the hedge. Come on, Jack, get in. Go on, head first is best. That's it, that's it. Get right in there. Yeah, better technique there from Jacko. And oh, Tyler could be like a little terrier, couldn't he? It's not going to there, he's got the gloves on. Ah, Jacko's done the job. Superb. I was quite chuffed with that, look at that. Ooh, bit of turn there. Flight and turn. That's gone out of the ground. That's a lovely shot. Super shot. There we go. Halfway stage. So Chessington need what? 122 off 20. That's just over six and over. Oh, that's a nice hit. Lovely shot. Straight through long off for four. Beautiful. Oh, Oh, hello. It really was a way we're doing. Super stuff. Chris Bowman there. Senior pro. Good work. No ball free hit. Ah, oh, it's a nicely played shot. 108 to win. 17 overs. Four wickets. Longcock continues. Big old full toss there. George has got it. Just the one. Yeah, good bowling. So Chris Bowman now into the attack. Ooh. Starts off with a bit of a loosener. Jacko's got it. You don't run two to him. Ooh, a bit of turn there for Chris. Got Jacko with me, George. Yep. It's a cold day today. Yep. Give us a word that rhymes with cold that hasn't been said before. Mold. Mold. We've had that, mate. Have you? Yeah, yeah. So that's a pint you owe me. I didn't tell you that bit. No, you didn't say that part. <laughs> I'll let you off. <laughs> Bowling. <laughs> May have turned a little bit too much. Oh, Chris here, primarily a batsman. Uh, came from the Gold Coast, Brisbane. Apparently he's got a first grade ton in Australia. Long time ago, came here as an overseas pro for Waterlooville in uh, Hampshire Prem and then played for Spencer for a few years. But he's moved in just down the road from Somerset. He actually can walk home or stagger home more likely, which he's done a few times. And we're really delighted to have him. Can bowl a bit too. Oh, what a delivery. He actually bowled for Waterloo. Run rate required, creeping up just under seven now. 102 needed or 15. So. Well, that's good bowling. Oh, that's bowling. Played back again. Probably uh, slightly flatter. But whatever. It's out. That's another one for Longcock. Uh, two for him. Seven down now. Oh, I think this is the one they called Hagrid coming into bat. He looks like a sort of chap that might give the ball a bit of a biff. Might go after Johnny. And why not? Oh, that's got to be close. And he's gone. Yeah, right in front there. That's um, eight down. Oh, 
Oh, Tyler just couldn't quite get his leg over there. Oh, and that really was uh, pretty nailed on. Well, that's nine down now. It's uh, it's getting close to bar time. It's cold as well. Good over. Well, it'll be a good, good one to win from here. Johnny having a little break and Jack Dinning comes on with his leg breaks. So who's going to get this last wicket? Ooh, big old swing into the outfield. Plugs, maybe a bit of backspin there. Couple of runs. Oh, ball. Big old long hop there. And he's hit that well for six straight into the net. Magnificent shot. Bit of rip there. Oh, and that's. <laughs> what a ridiculous catch. <laughs> oh dear, plays the reverse. Chris Bowen somehow, somehow manages to deflect that, and Simon well, just picks it off. So that's um, a magnificent victory for Sarnestead. Batted well, um, and then bowled well, particularly the slow bowlers. Fab fabulous stuff. Um, there's the score. What's that? 94 all out. So. Yeah, Sunstead could well have moved up into possibly third position in this league with one game left next week against Sutton. But for now, I think we'll go and uh, see what's happening in and around the bar. Well, the game's certainly played in good spirit. Well done, the Chessington lads. And uh, if you can, support their appeal for um, to get some new nets in memory of uh, one of their Colts who sadly was... Killed on his bike going to work uh, quite a few years ago, so do what you can. Thank you, viewers, until uh, well, we've got a game tomorrow. Um, until next time, goodbye.